This is the Bill Conch Biometric Safe. Just because it gets a good rating on Amazon doesn't mean it's a good buy. The safe has the worst biometric scanner I've tested yet. The automatic opening lid works, then stops working, then starts working hmm. again. And now to the worst thing I discovered. When you press down on the right side of the lid to shut the safe, it gives you a false locking of the safe. A gentle touch by your hand uh -oh. can trigger the automatic lid or semi-automatic lid to open. And the app is a connection oh nightmare. God. The safe gets a huge fail. Die. If you want a biometric safe with every possible combination of entry, then the Syfy safe is your safe. You can open it with a fingerprint scan, digital keypad, RFID card, or through your smartphone. And also, don't forget the good old-fashioned analog key. But if that's not good enough for you, you can get this sold separate button key fob. Or if you want voice activation, you can get this little white box, and then you can yell at Alexa to open the safe for you. Now, during my test, I confirmed the lid is 11 gauge steel, as you can see here. They say the lid is drill proof. So if it's really drill proof, then that means it's hard and still. So I tested the lid with this cheap $2,200 UCI tester just to see how hard it is. The finish is very hard, coming at 65 Rockwell hardness, but still the finish easily dremels off and the bare metal comes in at 45 HRC. Yes, it's hard and still, as hard as your Colt 1911 that is. Be forewarned, the safe is 100% programmed through your smartphone. Good news is it's always quick to connect to Bluetooth and it's super easy to reprogram the safe through the app. When it comes to the wet and powder test, it was not the best performer and I barely gave it a pass and my conscience is still bugging me on that. Syfy states it opens in 3 tenths of a second, but in reality it comes in at one second flat. And now onto the bad news, the safe has bugs. Not those bugs, but these bugs. And I'll show you live right here what just happened. One time I went to open it. And there you go, it did exactly that. He put the lid down, it didn't latch it, and I had to cycle the save like this, and then I was able to lock it. Uh, now the uh, other issue, hold on. Maybe I just, I didn't give enough time, so here we go. Uh, shouldn't be an issue. The Cyphly safe gets a marginal ready from us. It's still a million times better than that Bill Conch safe, and in the end, that's all that really matters. The AllSafe is the fastest biometric safe we've ever tested. It only took 4 tenths of a second to unlock the safe. Its gas strut was on the slower side as you can see here, and the lid doesn't open even close to Century 79 degrees of opening. But AllSafe is still the king when it comes to the biometric scanner time. When you first pull the AllSafe from the box, it feels lighter than the 10 pounds that AllSafe states. And the scale never lies as the all safe comes in at just 8 pounds. Three ways of entry, fingerprint, digital number pad, or with these two keys. Now onto the wet and powder test, the all safe biometric scanner is super sensitive to the wet test as you can see here. Even with multiple scans of the same fingerprint, it failed the wet test. It did fare better with the powder test. So in all, it gets a marginal rating from these tests. In normal operation, the AllSafe did run bug free. These would make a good storage safe or one to keep the kids away from your firearms. This is not my go-to bump of the night type of safe. It's more of my storage safe. So it gets a marginal plus from us. If you need a biometric safe that can fit four pistols, then the x -Deer is worth a look. I was able to store eight pistols in the x -Deer if you're willing to double stack, so there's plenty of storage options. There are three ways of entry. First, with the biometric scanner. With my test, it opened the safe in a good one second flat. Also has backlit digital number pad and comes with these backup keys. Features an interior LED light and the option to power the safe with four AAA batteries or use the supplied power adapter for a permanent powering option. The x -Deer is highly sensitive to my moisture test, and as you can see here, didn't do so well. It did pass one time. It did fare better with the powder test, but was still not great and received a marginal score for the powder test. The good news is the exterior performed flawlessly under normal operating conditions, pretty much a zero bug free safe. The biometric sensor is on the smaller side and sometimes can misplace your finger and get the red light of no entry. If you need a more storage type safe for up to eight pistols, I would recommend the exterior. Would it be my go-to defensive safe? No. Overall, it gets a marginal rating from us. If you're looking for a reliable mid-tier safe with a solid build, then the Sentry Biometric Safe has been a flawless performer. Coming in at 12 pounds with a thick 12 gauge steel lid, we love its powerful gas strut and you will find yourself using it as a makeshift catapult. There are three ways of entry, starting with a biometric finger scanner, digital number pad, or good old fashioned keys. The biometric scanner is on the small side and you will have to place your finger precisely or risk the red light of no entry. But if you do, the biometric scanner opens in one second flat. One other thing besides the small scanner size is the limit of only 10 fingerprints. Fortunately, it's a good quality scanner and works well with only one print. Some other safes need multiple scans of the same finger for better performance, but that's not the case with this entry safe. 
When it comes to my wet and powder test, it performed well, and it got a pass from us. It's not the best performer, but good enough. With all my testing, lots of opening and closing, it's performed 100%. If you want a good biometric safe you can count on, then this Sentry Safe is a good performer that also offers good protection for its price point. The Sentry Safe is part of our long-term testing project and gets a pass from us. If you want the best small smart safe with a quick access biometric scanner that opens in just 1.1 seconds, the vault Tech VS20i is your only real option. When you pull the safe from the box for the first time, you know it's easily in another league. This olive green vault Tech features vault Tech's all new Bluetooth 2.0 that seamlessly connects to your smartphone, allows you to open the safe through the app or check in on who, what, and when opened the safe. With vault Tech's app, you can view battery status, tamper indicator, toggle sound, and view the history log, as well as many other settings and options. It can hold up to 20 unique fingerprints with two administrators. The number pad can have as low as a four digit code, or up to 8 digits max. Quick access with the high resolution fingerprint scanner or with the auto illuminating number pad with a built in proximity sensor as you can see here will automatically jump to life. Eliminating the need to press a button like other brands and if the need comes up comes with these two backup keys. Build material is 16 gauge carbon steel with excellent fit and finish. Comes with a rechargeable 2200 mAh battery and they also include all charging hardware and when fully charged provides up to 46 months of power, automatic interior LED light and automatic opening lid. There are two ways of securing this safe one is with the provided tether cord or you can permanently mount the safe as you can see here with these two pre-drilled locations all mounting hardware is provided you will need to provide your own lock if you want to use the tether cord it's not cheap but as soon as you place your hand on the safe you know it was the right decision if you want the smart safe version of a fort knox or v-line this is it this is part of our long-term testing program and is 100 percent recommended from us this is a verified biometric smart safe. It has the only FBI certified fingerprint sensor in any biometric gun safe. Features a large area capacitive touch chip sensor for super quick access. Tested with the FBI's IGN or next generation identification standard for fingerprint quality. Anti-spoof 3D technology works below the surface of the skin to recognize living tissue and also recognize worn, dirty, or delicate fingerprints that other sensors won't. We have put the safe to test in other videos, so check it out on our channel. Here is a quick demonstration of opening the safe. And if all this fails, here is the backup keys and the access point is right here. The safe will also operate for years on a single set of batteries. You can also put it in the silent mode if it's your bedside safe and don't want to be disturbed. Tamper alerts are time stamped and secured within the safe's biometric safe's memory to keep you informed of backup key access, reset attempts, and unauthorized access. Pico Power CPU and Boost Power Technologies ensure LCD brightness and motor speed remain constant even when the batteries are nearly depleted. Battery life display on screen after every use. Features adjustable LED light, automatic locking door, carpeted interior, pre drilled holes for mounting, and a solid steel construction. Also comes in other sizes. For one for rifle and one for shotguns. With the smaller S5000 as we have here, we were able to find the best pistol rack giving you the storage for a compact XD9, Glock 21, PSA Dagger, Hellcat with Optic, SIG P365, XDS. Links for this rack in the description. Not only is this safe in the long term project, the safe is my personal safe and is 100% approved by us.